Top officials from over 50 countries have gathered here in Seoul for an important annual meeting. Korea's trade minister called on participants to work towards forging a sustainable and inclusive partnership among members. Cha Sang-mi takes us to the 7th Asia-Europe Ministerial Forum. On Thursday and Friday, Seoul hosted the 7th Asia-Europe Economic Minister's meeting under the theme of Innovative Partnership for Inclusive Prosperity. The forum comes 12 years since Asian and European economic chiefs last sat down together in the Netherlands. Korea's trade minister Pei gung in his opening remarks, called on fellow ministers to find ways to promote trade and investment and reinforce economic connectivity between Asia and Europe. Today, the global economy faces new challenges. Protectionism is rising and the industry around the world and undergoing fundamental structure changes. At this critical period, ASEM partners need to demonstrate our leadership given our central roles in the world economy. And Korea's Prime Minister Lee na reiterated the need for cooperation between ASEM members in his welcoming address. Economic leaders from 30 European and 21 Asian countries are gathered here to discuss ways to tackle growing protectionism around the world and to enhance mutual economic cooperation. At a press briefing, the economic experts announced what the forum had achieved, including plans to fight protectionism by supporting free trade and fully implementing a multilateral trade system, and boost economic connectivity by further collaborating in areas of common interest in both digital and physical matters. They also set goals for sustainable development in the era of fourth industrial revolution. Sustainability of our economic development uh, is key. There's uh, no other way to fight against poverty, to protect our planet, and to ensure prosperity. Given all the talk of cooperation, Mr. Baek had hoped to talk with his Chinese counterpart about Beijing's economic retaliation over Korea's deployment of Thought missile defense system. But the opportunity fell through after China decided to send its vice minister of trade and said. The growing importance of cooperation between Europe and Asia means we won't have to wait 12 years for the next forum, as the ASEM members decided to hold the meeting biennially, with the next one in Europe in 2019. Cha Sang-mi, Arirang News.